I always feel like I'm missing out whenever I don't have like a bottle to pop whenever we hit a milestone like this. But episode 700 of One Piece has arrived. A gigantic milestone. And honestly, I say this without trolling or like anything. I could take 700 more of this god dang peak show easily. And then another 700 on top of that. But I mean, we'll see, Oda. Maybe, yeah, possibly, huh? But guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and the reaction is to dress Rosa can den you. Uh, but it's not looking good for Luffy and Law, as Doflamingo has sort of detained both of them inherently. Yep, happened pretty quickly. We're gonna hop right into this. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub. It is never too late to join the subscriber base, and let's get started. Primula, a town look. Oh, okay, a northwestern town. Why are we specifying? This is just classic civilian on civilian violence, man. Seen it a few times throughout. I don't think anything gets worse than the father, like, shooting his child. Gotta be honest. The damn pirates! So is the Navy gonna, like, turn on everybody now since Fujitora said he believes in Luffy, basically? He's betting on Luffy, basically? Oh, I'm glad they're specifying specifying tranquilizer bullets. That makes me okay. That makes me feel way better. Holy, was that a giraffe? Kaku. Fight between Sabo and Isho. Wind up in a draw due to injury. Ah, yeah. I think Fujitora has to play this very carefully because if he if he shows that he's like believing in, in Luffy, he can't like say that. Ah, add a boy, Maynard. Keep trying to bring the confusion. Yes, just try to help the civilians, man. Atta boy. Oh, so they're shooting civilians with tranquilizers too. I see. Yeah, there are some good Navy men. I'm glad he really took what Fujitora told him, like, to heart. He literally can't just get them off? Dude, what are Luffy and Law supposed to do? And then Bellamy's attacking too! Against his consent! I deal smeal. Poor Bellamy, man. Dude, like, what are you supposed to do? Break out! Nice! There you go. Oh, so Octopus Stamp is like, is, is armament on his feet. It's like a Gatling, but his feet. I see. Oh my god, bro. How like outmatched they are. Oh my gosh. Oof. Oh! oh my god, kick them to the next floor. Oh, that is so gross. Oh, that is so gross. Oh. People are cruel, says you! <laughs> Dude, treble all cut up. <laughs> oh! He's ready to finish it. Oh, shoot. That's actually a pretty decent question. Yeah, actually true. Yeah, just because of how strong he is. Oh, so there's like actually a reason? I know about the important national treasure. Wait, what? That they have? What? Is a treasure? So he has leverage over them. Something that could shake the world by his very existence. Is it one of the three weapons? Oh my gosh. An escape he was most day. Oh my gosh. That's why they don't mess with him. If I could have had, could have had your fruit power in my hands that day. Taking the helm of the world. Oh, shoot. It has to be one of the weapons. And there's three, right? There's Shirahoshi. I forget which one she is. And then there's two others. There's another usage. Wait, what? It's a law's fruit? A lot of people call it the ultimate devil. I mean, I would believe it. Law is so busted. I, I have no interest. What? What? Just to grant another person eternal life? <gasps> Perpetual youth surgery. What? Does it have something to do with, like, taking their heart out? Oh, my gosh. You can give someone eternal life? Law just keeps getting more and more busted, man. It's actually impressive. How do you do it? And can you only do it like one time? Oh, it's a sacrificial play. Damn. Oh, they're fighting. He was going to have someone else eat it and then use it on him to give him like eternal life. 
And then Law take. Oh, shoot. Come on, Law! Oh, my gosh. Oh, he's showing everything he knows from the whole family. Diamante, Lao G. Gladius. Oh, no, everything Law's doing. Oh, shoot. Thanks to Corazon. Corazon. Oh, what? Oh, flash back! Law, 10 years old. He did say he was from the White Town. Actual flashback! Actual flashback! Spider Miles, 16 years ago. Port Town in the North Blue. Oh my gosh, Young Treble and Diamante. Is that Buffalo and Baby Five? Oh my gosh. Young Doflamingo! He's so drippy! Thanks, so they all been together for a long time. Oh my gosh. Dude, Doflamingo looks so cool. Even Buffalo and Baby Five been around since the beginning. So what's with the grenades around them? This kind of looks like um where freaking Sabo and uh, Sabo basically grew up. Oh, uh, the Great Terminal. It looks a lot like it. Dude, we're actually getting backstory, man. This is beautiful. He's had the hat since then, man. You can't live long and you'll die soon. Oh. Why does he have a sausage? Three years. Oh, wait. Oh. Why would he die? He had like an illness? Oh my gosh! So how did, did he live because he has the op op fruit? Oh, who's coming? <gasps> Corazon! Oh, he had the freaking feathers! Oh, they were his! Oh, shoot. Oh, what? Oh. Is this like some One Piece trait? Like he just trips? He's got hearts all over him. Yo, he kind of looked like Joker. He got like mouth, like face paint. So he had the feathers originally. Dude, Dolphy jacked his flow. Oh shoot. He had the glasses too. He did jack his flow. I guess Doflamingo has glasses now, even in this flashback. So what happened between Doflamingo and Corazon? Bro, what is this guy? He's not even spoken yet. Oh, now he is. Oh, wait, no, he hasn't. Absent-minded idiot. Oh. Yeah, we know it's Doflamingo's brother. He can't speak. Oh. Oh. Doesn't like kids. Oh, my. Oh, oh damn. He is a bit of a nut job, yeah. Corazon. Mmm. Oh, what? Did he light on fire? Bro, Corazon is a mess. Oh my gosh, bro. So what happened between Law and Corazon then? I'm guessing Corazon is the reason Law is alive, or it is because of his devil fruit power. 701. You know how geeked I am that we're still in this backstory. Oh my gosh. We're finally finding out more. DDF. So this is like their fort. It's interesting how Corazon doesn't speak. There's no way that's who I think it is, bro. Is that Senor Pink? Oh my gosh, it is him. Dude, he used to wear a suit? Oh my gosh. Why does Corazon hate kids so much? <laughs> bro, what? More importantly, what the hell happened to Senor Pink? Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, no, Doflamingo had the, the feathers back then, too. Okay, so it was just like a brother's thing. Dude, Pika, Lao G, they're all OGs, man. Oh, my gosh. And Law was right there with him. So Doflamingo really took him in. And usually kids run away by now. Dude, even Buffalo was laughing at Pika's voice back then. The blood law? Uh. <laughs> I like how Buffalo and Baby Five were close back then, too. 
Dolphin goes like, you ain't seen nothing, kid. My precious biology. He said my precious brother. Bro, he cared about him so much. What happened? What? White lead disease? Oh, that's why he would die in three years. Not contagious. Poor little law. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't push your luck. Oh my gosh. He was really out to get him. Children are idiots, says the child. Oh my bro. Rakesh. That's what he said, Rakesh. They were gonna go there. Dude, I bet they were freaking unstoppable forces. Yeah, this family, man. Dude, what happened to Lao G? Oh my gosh. Oh, I, dude, I really can't get over Senor Pink. What happened there, man? What what occurred in Senor Pink's life? Lao G had like this entire bunny theme. Like, my God, guys, what happened? We're so washed. Oh, Flavins was rich. And the towns were all white from the soil to the plants. That's why it was called the White Town. And the white lead killed them all. Oh, dude. Oh, no, it didn't. Oh, but the poisoning. Dude. That's beautiful. White lead made them a fortune, but it was their downfall. That's why all those clothes are like white themed. Oh, dude, it's cool, like, finally finding out more about Law's past. Is that his dad? Oh, my. He had a sister? Oh. What happened to Flevins? Dude, that's crazy, though, that they were, like, all doctors. Like, the, it was a family of doctors. Oh. And now he has the op-op for it. He's the surgeon of death. It's the pinnacle of living. Oh my gosh. Are Doflamingo's glasses off? Oh my god, bro. Have we ever seen him with his glasses off? I don't know. I think that would change me forever. Oh, he's reading a book about it. Uh, of course people wanted it. Performed a geological survey. Oh, all the white lead was put. Oh, not harmful unless you dig it up. Oof. This is their downfall. Oh my gosh, they just let all the civilians take the fall with their bodies. Holy. After a geological survey, they knew. That's why Law has three years to live. This doesn't just kill him right away. It just shortens his lifespan. Oh my gosh, your bloodline just screwed. Damn. It was too late. Oh, jeez, man. Another example of the government knowing something completely horrible and continuing to ignore it. Incredible. Because they knew they would make money. So I want to know, like, when everybody actually realized it, if there was, like, a moment or if they just slowly died off. Look at little Law, man. So happy. Lammy was his sister. Mm. Oh my gosh. But it wasn't contagious. And Lammy died. There's nothing he could do. What? Oh my gosh! They trapped them in! Holy sh man! They were just trapped in to die! Even though it wasn't even contagious! Self-defense because they didn't want a virus to like break out, basically. 
Oh my gosh, no wonder Lost said he's seen hell. Never mind. I I feel so bad now. I thought bro just like ran away. Oh my oh my gosh. Oh wait, but they would lie. They wouldn't let it. The... They thought it was contagious. They don't care that they're children. Oh my gosh, this just gets worse and worse. Even in the pits of war, he's still trying to figure out how to get rid of it. They just hang up. Oh, this is so f man. Oh my gosh. Bro. Oh, this is so fucked. Oh my god, he had her in a closet. They were specifically looking for them. Oh my god, they killed everyone. His father and mother like died, like basically just looking for a cure. Oh my gosh. He has seen hell. Holy shit. I'm so, I'm so horrible for like, just like writing him off. He had, oh my, oh my God. Oh my gosh. Holy shit. Oh Oh my god, man. That is ins oh, that is insane. My people's hands at last. It's a goddamn, like, miracle that he even made it alive. And that idiot is alive. He's just reading the paper. Oh! Oh! No way! Oh my god, I was like laughing because I thought he would just like dodge him. Oh my gosh! How did Dolomingo not just kill him right then and there? Oh my gosh, man, that backstory was getting rough. I I, I completely regret asking to, to know more, man. Oh my god, that was horrible. Like the, the straight up massacre of all his classmates and the sister. Oh my gosh, man. Oda just bodies me with dark stories. It is horrible. I again, I feel so bad because like he's like, I've seen hell. And I'm like, oh yeah, like probably like something bad happened. No, like he's actually seen hell on earth. The entire thing that happened to Flavin that that is horrendous the entire just civilization just just completely obliterated sectioned off and obliterated oh that is disgusting man again a more reason to just hate the government more and more them knowing the secret behind it and then just not saying anything because again it was at that point a little bit too late because they knew that it was already like generational and they were making money off of it so why would they tell them at, uh, aside from just like being <laughs> pure evil oh my gosh man Man. But the, the real curiosity is what happens with Corazon. Why Law cares so much about him in this uh, than the now and how the then transpired. And I guess I hopefully will learn more. But finally, we're getting it. And it's not just kind of like teasing us. But guys, that has been it for my reaction today. I hope you did enjoy. Hopefully, the tears are done. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a sub so you don't miss anything else. And I'll catch you next time. Peace, peace.